So here's how you figure out how many one half cups are in two thirds of a cup. So think of it this way. We could take here, we have one of two, one part of two, that's our one half. So one half. Over here, two parts of three. So one, two, and then there's the third part. So we can kind of see that when we have this one half here, it's one of them will fit in, but not two. So, but how do we figure that other space out? So here's the mathematical way to do it. We take our two thirds cup and we're trying to see how many times one half goes into the two thirds. So we're just going to divide by one half. But when we're dividing fractions, we can make it a lot easier. We can take the two, move it up here and the one down here. That's the reciprocal. Then instead of division, we're just going to multiply. And that's a lot easier because two times two, that equals four and three times one, that equals three. So how many one half cups go into a two third cup? Four over three. Let's change this to a mixed number. It's a little easier to understand. Three goes into four one time with one times three is three and we have one left over. Bring the three across. So we could say that one half cups, one and one third of these half cups will go into two thirds of a cup. That's it. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.